just gonna go over there, but I saw you and I, I think I'll just stay. <laughs> My uh, first guest tonight is a very funny man. Thank goodness. He's a good friend of the show. Uh, he smells a bit like lavender. <laughs> Craig, you're giving away the secrets of show business. Yes, I am. <laughs> Please welcome the lovely Jeffrey Tambor, everybody. <laughs> Jeffrey Tambor. I forgot how you keep it really cold in here. Yeah, I have to. I'm, wow. uh, I've got, I'm, I'm kind of sick. I'm trying to freeze the illness out of my body. Oh, I got you. Well, yeah. because I can feel my testicles getting really just... <laughs> like, uh, like in, a, like in a, uh, the, the pool. <laughs> well, good night. Good night. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, <laughs> hey, uh, hey, uh, Jeffrey, have you ever been to Sweden? No. Anyhow, really? Um, no, uh, I haven't. How did you get sick? Oh, my kid. Yeah. Yeah, he started off in the, uh, with the youngest one. The oldest one, I've been sick from all the things that he gave me, but yeah. now the youngest one's going to uh, yeah. the, the mommy and me things. Yeah. And so they come back, they're all, Whoa. Yeah, I have four kids. So you're sick all the time? No, not really. <laughs> yes, we are constantly always, always uh, getting sick. I have a seven-year-old, five-year-old, and two twin boys, two years old. Grief. Yeah. So. Why? Why so many? Um, oh, it's your uh, huge testicles. You're going to shrink. No, it really. You probably want really... to spend more time in a cold pool, Mister. Yes. Um, why do you keep it so very cold? Here. Uh, well, you want me to tell you why? Because encourage Swedish girls to come in. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> They're like, I where understand. can we find a place that's a little bit like Sweden? In here. <laughs> It's a little cold. Well, um, uh, so you're good? Okay. No, no I'm, I'm yeah. What would you mean, me too? I think we're doing a film of Arrested Development. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. oh, I have to tell you something. Oh, oh this is huge. Oh, no, no, this is huge. Much, uh, much, really important. Okay. You are a... Look at my uh, finger. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They look a bit like you've been in the pool, actually. I know. Yeah, what the that, hell is going on? You get, can you get a close-up of Jeffrey's fingers? Look at this. Look at that. Look, that look. Isn't that weird? Yeah. What tiny little hands you have, too. You Thank that? you. Yeah. We always do this. Anyway, um, you were a hero in my house, hold, because of Gobbo. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, you were in a hero in my house, hold. Oh, because... household. I see. I thought you were a hero uh, in my house, hold. Well, no. I say... Like, don't I, say anything. And then... Uh, house... Hole how you're here in my because house. you play Gobbo. No, Gobber in How to Train Your Dragon, that movie? Yeah, that was me, yes. Oh, ah, yeah, break my... the wee things off, yes. <laughs> oh, and by the way, and by the way, audience, I think we're doing a film of Arrested Development. Yeah! <laughs> now, I, I don't want to be, um, um, but my, my son said um, that you are terrific and you have an obsession with your underpants. <laughs> How can he tell that from the movie? Yeah, I understand. <laughs> well, we come from a family of small testicles. Doesn't sound like that to me, no, I mean, anyway. because you have to get in the pool. Do you I... spend a lot of, do you have a swimming pool at your house? Come on, you oh, got some yes. money. Oh, yeah. absolutely. Yeah? Yeah. Well, uh, we, uh, the, the economic uh, times have hit us, too. We, really? Oh, yeah. So you had to have your swimming pool reduced in size? Reduced, and we had to let go, uh, we had to let go of one of our children. Oh. <laughs> And that was hard, but they understood. So what's he doing, uh, working up the chimneys then? That, that was, that was <laughs> Yes. <clears throat> um, and I, I, I come to you, I have a lot of fear uh, lately. Fear? Really? Talk to me. I, I'm, I'm pretty good at psychotherapy. Why, um, why do you think you get fear? I have to undergo a treatment. Uh-oh. What's going on? Do you snore? Uh, not during the show. <laughs> Unlike the audience. <laughs> uh, yeah, do I, do, I do snore, actually. Do you see this man in the second row? That man is scowling at me. Everyone is going like this. And there's one guy going like this. And I want to tell that, what is wrong? What did I do to this guy? It's that guy right there. You. Absolutely. What's up? The guy is I, like don't, I don't think he's scowling. I think he's got gas. Oh. Anyway. Yeah. I don't need to be treated like this. And I won't. Actually, you do. Okay. All right. I snore in my sleep, and my wife has kicked me out of the room. Uh-oh. Yeah. So you want to talk about your uh, sex life? 
Anyhow. Uh, and I have to go to a sleep center. Oh. Um, that's good. Is this the most exciting interview you've ever had? No. Oh. <laughs> And uh, I have to find out if I have apnea. Is that what oh, sleep apnea? Yeah, yeah. that can be dangerous. Yeah, now, you my be wife yeah. told me, here's how I sound. I don't sound like this. <laughs> I sound like this. First of all, I think I just... Yeah, I think you did something. something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, a glass of water over there. Yeah. Excuse me. Give yourself to that. Yeah. I, think I just ingested are you my wearing, brain. Are you wearing jeans? You're wearing jeans on the show? What the hell? <laughs> I, I wear a suit. You can wear a pair of jeans. What the hell? Who the hell? Who the hell do you think you are? I'm just vamping while you have a drink. Who Hell, do you think? Right, we good? He's back to scowling again. Right, right. yeah, I know. Well, he saw um, your jeans. And so I snore like this. <laughs> so I don't know if that's technically snoring. <laughs> that, that might be dying, actually, right there. So I have to go to a place called a sleep center. Yeah. And you know you have to sleep. Well, I can't do that. Well, 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 then well, why go? Well, do you well, uh, do you go like this to your wife and say and turn off the lights and say good night, darling, and go no, to sleep? Sir. I'm right. <laughs> I mean, no one does that. Who go? Good night. Who does that? I have to have the television on. Sorry, did I make you uncomfortable? No, I made my collar pop. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> and um, what are we talking about? I don't know. I stopped listening about it. Uh, anyhow. <laughs> And uh, so uh, you have to go uh, and you have to uh, sleep there. Well, I can't sleep there. But I called the sleep center and you think they would go, hello, sleep center. Now there's a man y yawning no, you, in the first row. You got, look, He's I now stop. yawning. He just went like this. Well, you, I, you're talking about sleep. It's, it's, oh, it's, okay, uh, that's right. Right. So uh, I called there and you, you think, uh, they answered the phone and you think it was, hi, sleep center. No, no. He went, sleep center. <laughs> Well, I'm not going to a place like that. Why? That's, that's where you sleep. Sleep center. I, I said, hi, I'm Jeffrey Tambor. Silence. <laughs> oh, nothing. So he said, your birthday, please. <laughs> I said, what does that have to do with sleep or anything? He went, your birthday, please. So already I have trouble. Uh, Does this go on for a long time? Because I'm really overdue for some commercials. <laughs> I don't want to be insensitive, but I mean, they're, they're about a minute and a half late, and I've been really getting a hard time from Michael. Oh, sure, just to stand up with Sweden and this and that and that. I, I am pouring out my heart to you. I am about to go to a sleep center where I cannot sleep. Maybe, maybe they're one of our sponsors tonight. Let's take a look. I love you too. I love you too. I'm very worried about you. What? I know. Oh, okay. I know. I know. Okay. I know. Well, it's, it's kind of sudden, but. Uh... Welcome back. I'm here with Jeffrey Tambor. That's the only thing we ever put on that thing. I know. You might, we, we want to take a look at that, actually. You should probably not bother with that anymore. I kind of know who he is. Look, can you see the shot of the camera? They put that thing in where it says, Welcome back. I'm here with Jeffrey Tambor in case I forget. <laughs> so, so then they, uh, if you sleep, oh, I said. Oh, so, no, we're out so, of time, Jeffrey. So, uh, <laughs> what do you want to do? You want, uh, you want the big cash prize in Mouth Oregon? Oh, or I the... do. I have no money and I need money. So, oh, okay. Um, you want a big cash no, prize? No, no, no. I have to get some stuff at uh, uh, Gelson's on the way home. <laughs> Is that all right? Can you say that? Okay. Oh, Vaughn's? <laughs> I have to get some. Well, let's do oh, different things. Right, I have right. to get some stuff at Ralph's on the way home. Yeah. Oh, I have to get some no, stuff no, at Ralph's no, on no, the way no, home. No, 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 no. Oh, I have to get some at Scott Tyler's on the way home. It's time for the big cash prize. All right, all right, here you go. Here's the money that you can win really? if you answer the question. It's fifty dollars in quarters really in a bag with a dollar sign on it. <laughs> and they put the sleep mask on. All right. <laughs> You can either you uh, guess what's in my box or you can answer and the question. <laughs> right, uh, here you are. So answer the question, you say. Fair enough. Iceland is in the North Atlantic. It's Reykjavik. Uh, yes, that's true. Uh, uh, within 10%, what percentage of people dream in black and white but never in color? It's a sleep-related question. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12%. 12
That's amazing. It's almost as if you I looked. Just, I looked it over your shoulder. <laughs> Good enough.